I'm Camilla Ortiz, and here is tonight's Fox 12 flash briefing. Starting tomorrow, people ages 80 and older will be able to sign up for a vaccine in Oregon. Part of the problem is the state just isn't getting enough doses to meet the demand, and that demand will only increase as more age groups become eligible for the COVID vaccine in the coming weeks. The Oregon Health Authority reports 393 new cases of COVID-19 in the past 24 hours. That's the lowest one-day total since the end of October. There were also four additional deaths. OHA says the number of hospitalizations from the coronavirus has been trending downward. Portland police are investigating a deadly hit and run. This happened around 7 o'clock last night on Southeast Stark and 136th Avenue. Police say they found a person dead in the street and the car involved had left before officers got there. Right now, police don't have a suspect or car description. If you know anything, you're asked to call 911. Now here's Chief Meteorologist Mark Nelson with a check of the weather. Camilla, at 6 o'clock, we still have a little bit of daylight out there and uh, we've got mainly cloudy skies. There are some scattered showers kind of roaming about, but notice the pavement right here from our Riverview Community Bank Cam is looking pretty dry. Here's a closer view and you can see some scattered showers there, maybe right around the Bethany area, maybe some more out here around banks and uh, a lot of us just dry at this hour. Looks like it'll be uh, partly cloudy, mainly cloudy this evening. Temperatures drop to the upper 30s by midnight, just a shower or two, a little bit of a southwesterly breeze. So basically there's not much of anything going on this evening, but uh, we do have one bright sunny day in our seven day forecast and Probably our best chance for snow this season in the lowlands. We're going to show you where, when, and what we're thinking and what's going on for later this week in our seven day. That's in a, on our shows this evening, Camilla. All right, Mark, thanks for news and weather updates anytime. Just download the Fox 12 app on your phone or tablet or log on to our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash Fox 12.